Alright, hello folks, I am Zombie Skittles. Welcome back to Hand of Fate. I'm gonna do something there is strength in that. I didn't want to do. And I'm really sorry that I'm doing this because I feel like I'm cheating the whole concept of this Let's Play, but... I want to finish this Let's Play. I'm gonna be honest with you, and I don't want to have to... Impossible. ...do a billion episodes. I already scrapped three more. Just because I didn't want to endlessly die, so... Here we go. We're going with easy mode. I am stronger, enemies are weaker, and some achievements cannot be unlocked. Inexperienced at war, you seek out a place to learn how to handle a blade. Play the game as the gods do, without consequence or concern. Apprentice easy mode, I'm so sad. Alright, I will come back one day, and one day soon in fact, because achievement hall, like I said, and I want to beat this game, but... Like, I want to get the achievements, but for now, I want to experience the story. And I feel like I'm, I've am i hit a wall, skill-wise, with this that. Thing I have created. Guardian Angel, first chance, and Skeleton King Shield. Beautiful, I love the Skeleton King Shield. Skeleton King Shield. Skeleton Shield. Oh my god, at the start of each combat, a random opponent is highlighted and gives you five gold as generosity of his heart. Apprentice 1. The experience... What is the blue token? You seek out a place to learn how to handle a blade. In a local tavern, you manage to corner a guardsman captain. Alert. This is new. The next morning, you quietly file into the other in, in next to the other recruits. The captain appears to address them. Watch your opponents wait until they're about to strike. This is almost like a tutorial esque training. Counter attacks are lethal. Okay. Okay. This is different. This is like, okay, so, counter attacks are lethal, so I just gotta counter everyone. Alright. You're all dead. Now, what, do I get that token? Because it's a blue token. Junk gathering means it's only for apprentices, which means it's their apprentice only cards that are to be unlocked. This card token is now yours. Okay. Trading post. All right, that's a normal one. Uh, oh, but I'll trade you food for supplies. Pay twelve food for a random helmet, random shield, random armor. Hmm. Let's see what shield it gives me. Draw one shield card. Enormous shield. I regret doing that because I had the skeleton shield, but armor, armor level is increased and it can knock the enemies down, but reduces your movement speed. I'm not going to equip it, but we'll sell it later for some. Hey, ha here, have this on the house. He trades you an unusual suit of armor, saying, I traded it for a bear skin, but I don't think it was worth it. You put the armor away to be identified later. And that'll be what's in the token. All right, so two steps and we've already gotten two tokens. That's interesting. And we could be going for a third. Charity. You encounter a wandering priest. Give food to the priest. Worthy decision. Beyond poverty, religion, and charity. Let's do five food. The priest humbly accepts your provisions. Let's see if I have anything in my sack. Apart from my bowls. All right. So we know we know that's a failure. That one right there. So what about this one? That's a success. Beautiful. Check it. Knew it was a failure. So good. Too good. The best. Uh, the dealer draws you one game card. Draw one blessing, which is the headsman's blessing. I'm I sick of getting that blessing. Too powerful. I will have we to have three tokens. This is ridiculous. This card will unlock more cards Lose three gold. I'm cool with that. More. Metal war. Dig deeply if you wish to discover the heart of this mystery. Yeah, I probably should have also stuck with the normal difficulty, but a voyage across the ocean. Blue tokens, man. This is different. Does that mean if I go into the harder mode, there's going to be more, this like another set of tokens? Way. Noble trader, is he going to notice anything about me? Uh, your shield reminds me of one I myself bore as an adventurous young lad. I offer you gold for it. Yes! I've got two two shields. Remember the days when I would kill a dozen lizard men before breakfast, he says, smiling fondly. He spent another hour listening to tales of his youth. Deal draws you four game cards. He gives you 25 gold for it. 28 gold for it. Uh, that would be 43 gold, 48 gold. That's not too bad. I reckon I could have gotten more at a trader, though. Lose 10 max health. 
That is fine. Ember Town Hero. Hello, Ember Town Hero. Long time no see. That goes all the way up there. But you know what? Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Goodbye. We're going. We're going downtown. All right. 60 gold. Let's go south. Cave rescue. It only draws you two monster cards. Dust, three of mages. You must fight for your life. I am a maiden. I want to know what lies beyond that. Alright. Cool stuff. Let's go. I've got a sword. Instead of an axe. Freaking mages, man. Enough of your shit! Yeah, that's right, you take it. Alright, you're dead. And you're going to be dead. Cool. Freaking mages, man, I swear. Oh no, he's doing the thing! Oh, uh, you're going down. As soon as I can get to you, you're going down, mate. Oh, you're trying that. Trying to be crafty. Well, guess what? Boom! You're dead. Slice. Love it. Alright. It feels just as fulfilling doing this mode as doing the default mode, but... Well, 5 max health. 10 health, so we're fully healed as well. And we get some more food to I'm just sure help us survive. For that. I am. I'm, 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 I'm okay with that. Till it draws you one food. What? You agreed to buy a kind merchant who offers you... What? This is easy mode. All right, Angel Wings. This helm imbues the wearer with greater movement speed. We're going to take that. Really? Is that, is that what, what you're going to do? All right, we're just going to quickly check our inventory. Do we have our shield equipped? Where's our shield? It's there. We have the enormous shield equipped. Cool. All right. Choose your next card. Well, of course we've got to go up. We lose five health. Nasty. Meh. I've still got. Even though the shop was okay. So we're going to approach this shop and see what he has. I assume he's just going to be selling rings and shit, but... Alright. Buy items. Lightning tr lightning crash. I thought I said lightning trash. During combat, press right bump to activate a fire form. War cry to perform damaging attacks. And ring of justice to herp de derp Let's just buy some food quickly. Uh, we're going to get two food. Because I want to keep 50 gold just in case we encounter um, that merchant that's always asking for gold, you know? Because I think he gives us a return of even more gold, if I recall correctly. What do we got here? Desert Storm, another token. Nature is the greatest threat, even with a queen now dispatched. Be swift. You are traveling through a desert when a dust storm approaches. You may be able to reach the safety of some nearby hills before the storm hits you. Run for the hills. Run for the hills. Run for your life. I can't sing and I'm so sorry for that. But Iron Maiden, bro. Iron Maiden. And now we've got a fourth token. It's not even sitting in the bowl. Alright. We don't want to go to you, sir. Get out of my life. Maybe if you were selling some weapons. Cave shelter. Holy crap. Another one. It's inhabited. Uh, you enter a cave intending to shelter from a heavy storm when you discover signs that it is already inhabited by monsters. Boldly go into the cave. You yell a challenge into the darkness. Four of plague, six of scales, ten monsters. More lizardmen than you usually see together. This is true. Alright. The rats are probably going to be some of the hardest ones for me. Alright. Mainly because of their poison shit. Alright, cool. Alright, he's about to poison. Yep, I got poisoned. Whoops. We're doing okay though. Alright. Yep. 
Why are the lizards and the rats together is beyond me, though. Alright. Yep, yep, yep. How much health have we lost? We've only lost 9 health. That's actually pretty good. They keep firing shit at me. Stop it! Jesus, am I just going to sit here and press Y indefinitely? Hope not. That would be boring. Alright, you know what? We're going to take care of you guys. Oh, the freaking poison. Alright. 25 health down. Still not potentially lethal. So that's that's actually kind of a load off my mind, eh? Alright. Yep, yep. What are you doing? Alright, is he, is he dead? Please be dead. Okay, cool. Two left. We're actually making it through this. It's taken forever, though. Just you and me, compadre. You and me, buddy. You and me, friend. You and me, associate. Alright. Good thing I actually couldn't think of any more offhand. Alright. 15% max health. That's okay. 5% max health. There are a lot of max health cards in this deck. And I'm loving it. And is that another token? Five. Five freaking tokens, man. I hope these actually carry over into the uh, into the normal game because more cards is brilliant. I'm assuming the blue one doesn't, but you know. Okay, so we know it's not to the it would be left. So easy to create a game that merely defeats you. Oh no no no! no. That no chance. Also completely unfair. That is not how I work. Cool. I refuse to play in such a manner. Our game is fair. All right, we'll read your own. And you will be defeated fairly. That's so much better. Okay. Thank God for that second choice thing. Carefully make your way down. Draw one weapon card. What do we get? Thunderstrike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thunderstrike. Every strike inflicts lightning damage. Press left bumper for lightning to strike around you, as opposed to my sword. Oh, hells yeah, I am equipping a new weapon. So now I don't even need to go to you. Oh, I kind of do need to go to your shop, so now I regret wasting that food. Lose 10 max health. No one cares, mate. We're going to approach your shop and eat all your foods. Because that's how I ha I'm forced to roll right now. Must be relieved. Chance for you to shut your face. So, 5, 10... Cannot. 13 food. Should be enough. At least we would hope so. <sighs> Alright. Just can you cave enough? Uh, let's go up. Mr. Lionel, you better not take my shit this time, mate. Uh, ask him what he needs. Suddenly makes a grab at something. What was that? I didn't even see. He then sits there, slapping the table with his hand. Lets you draw four gold gain cards. Fifteen. I'm sure you are grateful for that. Thirty. Seven. Twenty. Not bad. Let's see what I lost. Better not be my fucking weapon, mate. Still got thunderstruck. He took my shield. He took my fucking shield, bro. Oh, and then I go the wrong way. I'm just. I'm that distraught. That distraught. Local peasant woman. You know, I don't know. Had it up to here with all of your shit, guys. Stranger in the shadows. Alright, cool. Accept. Have me. Take me. Accept. Alright. Of course I'm going to take the success. With the god card, it's actually going to be really good now. Uh, thank you. Accept. Success. I actually meant to take the last card, which was also a success, so that's brilliant. Alright. Thank you. I'm not sated yet. We're not taking that one. 
So we get a second chance. Alright, we know this is a success. Because I watched the failure end up on top, and then it ended up underneath. So the card on top the second time round was a success. Uh, thank you. I'm not yet sated. Decline. As you wish. Alright. Sensibility says that I should How use all this newfound gold to buy yet more food. But what we're actually going to do is we're going to walk on by the priest. And go straight for the shop. And see what he's selling food wise. Shady Grove approached the shop. Greetings wise traveler. I have much to offer you. Finally, an opportunity to eat. Yep. It's not like I've been eating filling my fat face this whole time. What are you selling? 10 gold for... 10 food for 30. I guess I have to take it because I, I chose to go to you. 30 food, man. 30 food. I am set. Probably shouldn't have bought that much, but... Eh. If this is indeed easy mode, I'm in for an easy time, so... Meh. Yep, yep, cool. We're gonna pass it on. Bye. Let's go south when we hit the cave mouth. Oh, we lost 50% of our gold. South was the right way. Sail away and see what you will find. Find your mama. Alright, so we know to, Again, that we can go around them. You come to the final floor. River! Alright. Can we get support. another token? Can we make this five tokens? Choose from these options. Yes, we can. As you swim, you notice some gleaming stones in the riverbed. If you had lighter armor, you could attempt to dive for them safely. The crossing is not easy, but you make it in one piece. Oh, that that sucks, but that makes sense. So if I've got light armor when I encounter that, I can swim down and get the token. Maze of traps. Don't play with your baubles. We're going to enter the cave. We're going to kick its ass. Check, checkity check, checkity check, checkity check. Oh yeah, it's gonna be an easy mode one, isn't it? That's cool. Ah, oh, I still take damage. That's cool. Yep, yep, yep. Into the trap. Cool story. Uh, into the trap. Ah, uh, oh my god, I'm just collecting them at this point. Go like that. Okay, this is done. All right, thunder strike. All right, what do I get? One to keep. Rat cleaver. We don't need lightning crash. We don't really need, but I guess we'll take it. During combat, press right bumper to knock back and stun all enemies who crash the lightning. That's kind of cool. I can double lightning. Uh, select one to keep. Huge hammer, fleet cuffs. What do they do? Increases the wearer's movement speed. The huge hammer is just a shit ton of damage, isn't it? 35. My my current weapon, I think, does the same amount, so... Whatever you want, mate. Just shut your face. Okay. He's like that old guy. It's like, pay attention to me! And we're all like, no, go away. Alright, take the hero's belongings. Yeah, why not? We'll just keep in mind where it is. Pain, cool sure story. Alright, right, where, where are you putting him? Where are you putting him? Come on, this is the information I need. You're making me go back. Alright, good thing I've got enough. I got food for days, so... Meh. Heroes return. You return the sword, return the thing. Uh, Wrath of the Old Very Gods. Nice. At the beginning of every battle, the Old Gods throw down thunder upon one of your enemies. Ooh, we're just, we're just made of lightning today, aren't we? Alright, we're gonna go there and skip. Pass it on by. So we can just go straight there. Lose one blessing. What do we lose? Headman's bless. The, the most worthless blessing to me. That's actually brilliant. Draw two monster cards. What do we get? Quick. Skulls and plague. Attempt to take them by surprise or sneak away. We're going to attempt to take them by surprise this time. You know, I'm sick of this shit. Sick of this running away. Guess what? Suddenly, you leap into the fray, taking them, one of them down before they can even react. Uh, choose a monster to discard. We're going to discard the plague. We're going to have the easy life of fighting four skulls. Not having to worry about poison. You know, none of that shit. So good. Look at all this lightning, man. Yeah. 
The freaking lightning meant, like, that freaking wrath of the old gods at the start killed one of them. So I only had three to put up with. Brilliant. The question is, what's going to happen when I fight the boss? Because the boss's minions are all immune unless he's dead. Five max health, that's cool. A little extra health. Yeah, that, it is so easy mode when you draw a card that just gives you 50. Emperor's Jewel. 50% chance to grant one free artifact per use per combat. Yeah, I'll take that over having basic shield. You know, it's definitely an upgrade. Alright, what do we got? Loan. I don't have the gold as per usual. King of Scales, we're up to him. Alright. Measure. Your mum is powerful beyond measure. I should know. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Okay, sorry. Alright, who does it rain down on? If anyone. It. Okay, it didn't even hurt him. That was what I was worried would happen. Alright, cool, cool, cool. And then we go like this. He's dead! Oh wow, that is way easier. Did not expect it to be quite this easy. So, now I feel bad with... Although, I was going to say with this run I could have very easily taken it on, on normal mode. But, if it was normal mode I wouldn't have had this run. Alright, well that's over, unfortunately I don't get the achievement, which, you know, that's only fair, because I don't deserve the achievement. You have beaten all the members of my court, the game is done, do not think that this means you are beyond judgement, you have not won your life, no, oh. one more trick remains. And that's going to be you, isn't it? Anyway, dagger upgrades. New starting gear. Your starting equipment has been upgraded. Food or gold bonus. Each area you enter will be strewn with food and gold or gold. Swift feet. You move with increased speed. Lizardman fire armor. Lizardman fire breathers will now protect themselves with flame armor. Health increase for ratmen and a health increase for lizardmen. All right. The dagger is a symbol of the intellect's ability to cut through the ties that bind us. My intellect built this entire framework from the barest pieces. You dare take it from me? Alright, let's see what this is. For completing your training and counter attacks, you get Apprentice 2. For reaching the training post in the deep forest, you receive 10 food, trader's ring, wilderness armor. For donating food for the orphans, you receive five gold, uh, five food, sorry, Ring of Poverty, Charity 2. For surviving a desert storm, you receive Lost in the Desert. For exploring the cave during a heavy storm, three food per blessing. And as a reward for defeating my Lizardman King, you receive Blood Crescent, Master Ring, Ring of Peace, Soldiers on Leave. Game freezes. Sounds like game freeze. Game froze. Alright, well, that appears to be the end. Maybe only because I'm on easy mode, I'll take a look. But in the meantime, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next episode, if there is a next episode. But he did say I haven't won my life, so there must be a next episode. Regardless, I'll see you then.